It's necessary to equip the aircraft with the necessary ammunition before the battle. For this purpose, the bombs are transported on pallets by a special transporter. I can't even imagine how scared the driver must be, because he's carrying something that can blow up the whole city because of the slightest mistake. Then the military needs to provide reliable reconnaissance and protection for the bomber. It's necessary to accurately determine the location of the enemy so that the entire nuclear power does not fall somewhere else. The newest reconnaissance drones, the Global Hawk, are used for this purpose, capable of monitoring more than 130,200 square feet of territory from an altitude of 72,200 feet. Modern F-22 and F-35 fighters, as well as air defense systems, are responsible for covering B-2, and videos about them are also posted on the channel. In the case of the Spirit, its escort lasts exactly until it reaches the boundary line, a line after which enemy radars can easily detect other aircraft. Then the Spirit's left alone and the mission comes to its peak.